Hi everyone, this is Mr. Woods again, and today I'm talking about rounding whole numbers. We're going to be replacing a number with a simpler number or a number that is close to how many or how much. This is really used when you're estimating. And I'm going to, ooh, wait a minute, estimating? What is, esti what is an estimate when I'm trying to find an estimate? Well, rounding helps us to estimate and work with simpler numbers. Our vocabulary, estimate, find an answer close to the exact amount or a number close to an exact amount. And then I have this symbol here with two swiggly lines, one on top of the other, and that means approximately equal to, or it could also mean about. Let's continue. Here's what you need to remember for when you're rounding numbers. If the digit to the right is five or more, raise the score or round up. If it's four or less, let it rest or round down. So when we're looking at this, you're like, wait a minute, what does that mean? Well, when we're talking about to the right of the number, that means looking at the place values. So if you're looking at the tens, that's what you're rounding to, you have to look at the ones in the place value, which is to the right. Here example, round 3,764 to the nearest hundred. Look at the tens place. Six is greater than five, so we round the answer up to 3,800. Okay, let's practice here. I have two examples here, and let's say I want to look at this one here, and I want to go to the nearest thousands. Okay, and I'm looking at this and I want to round it to the nearest thousands. I can use this number line to help out. So if I'm looking at the nearest thousands, what's the next thousands up from this here? That's going to be seven, so that'd be 47,000 here. And the next, and the one down lower than this is going to be 46,000. I can look at that and go, wait a minute, where does this, it's 46, it's a little bit more than halfway, so I'm going to put it almost 47,000. Let's put it over here, and I want to round it. I want to see what's going on. So I look to the right, 9 is greater than 5, so that's greater than 5, and that means I round up. So I'm going to go up. So instead of being 40. 6,000, it's going to be 47,000. That's going to be my answer. Let's take a look at something else here. The next one. Let's say I want to round it to the nearest 10,000. Again, I look to the right, and 4, that's less than 5, so I round down. I'm like, wait a minute, this is 10,000. So if I'm rounding down, if I look up here, the next 10,000 up is going to be 40,000, and this down here is 30,000, and this here, number here, 34, here's middle, which is 35,000. This is over here, so that means I'm going to round down to 30,000. So this is my answer, 30,000.